In the Dark Multiverse, the Waynes and the Elliots go to the movies. Afterwards, as we know, the Waynes were shot dead, devastating Bruce. However, instead of Alfred becoming his guardian, the Elliots chose to raise Bruce, but he grew increasingly unstable. Bruce was later declared mentally unfit and was sent to a mental institution, with Thomas Elliot gaining control of Wayne Industries. Once Thomas became a senator, he had Bruce transferred to Arkham Asylum, where Dr. Crane performed experiments on him. While at Arkham, Bruce acquired several skills like lockpicking, unarmed combat, and other techniques from various criminals. Bruce decided to fake his own death to escape Arkham. However, before he left, he attacked Dr. Crane and shot down Thomas's helicopter. Later, in a warehouse, Thomas attends a meeting to find out who shot down his chopper, but Batman ambushes them and ends up fighting Jason Todd and Dick Grayson, allowing Thomas to escape. Thomas goes to Wayne Manor seeking answers. Bruce surprises him from underneath the wooden floor, dragging him down into the Batcave, where others are seen being held captive in cages. Bruce then reveals to Thomas that he knew what was going on for years. Thomas pleads for forgiveness, calling the two of them brothers. Bruce finishes him off and kills the rest of the Gotham elites.